Okay, let's do this exciting thing now. Um, you, if, you, if you're a, a, a regular and seasoned viewer, Gumper, of the Good Morning Portugal show, you'll have seen my up and down relationship with Revolut. I recommend for the big amounts, I recommend Spartan FX if, you're, if you want to actually have a, a friendly or a, a human relationship with somebody who can help you transfer, convert and transfer currency. Spartan FX are fantastic. For the Spartan FX don't have a debit card um, in the way that some currency exchanges do. So it might be that you want the convenience of a card, like a Revolut card or a Wise card. I have both. I'm a wise guy and a Revolut guy. Revolut, however, I was first registered with Revolut in the United Kingdom and they wouldn't allow me to transfer my account to Portugal. I could still use it, but there were features on it that I wanted to use, like uh, creating sub accounts for my kids. Uh, and I went through the most hideous Revoluts, basically. And that was my final message to Revolut was, um, look, are you called Revolut because of all these circles you're making me go around in for the last few months? That did the trick, I think, a little bit of a sarky, uh, sarky reaction and comment. Um, and now I am proud to reveal to you that I, I have a Portuguese account for my Revolut. They are, um, I don't know, they're not headquartered in Portugal, but they've got a very big center in Matosinhos up there near Porto, because uh, I met somebody who worked there, amazing fella actually, in, in their marketing team. But I think they've got a big team up there in the north of Portugal. So here I am opening live on air um, my um, Revolut card. And it comes in this. Look at this. It comes in a lovely little um, fold out piece of origami. Get my hand over the microphone there so you can see this. And it folds out in this beautiful way. I do now have a new Revolut card that's good to go. Uh, here in Portugal. And look what I was able to do on this said card, everybody. I've got my very own GMP Revolut card. How about that? Um, a GMP Visa card comes in this lovely fold-out thing, which I'll uh, uh, dazzle and amaze the kids with. Isn't that fantastic? It's like one of those things you made at school, isn't it? <laughs> Looks like it could take off if you flap it uh, hard enough, so to speak. There it is. There's my GMP Revolut card. Um, if you want one of these, hey, I should have been a bit more ahead of the game here. Um, what I'll do is I will put um, a link to Revolut. Um, it will be one of our nice little affiliated income and referral streams here on the Good Morning Portugal. Many a mickle makes a muckle. Um, so I will put a Revolut link for you if you want to get your own Revolut card. Um, some amazing features on it, like the sub accounts uh, for kids. Um, and um, so you can you can create a sort of a pocket money account and the kids um, can have their own can have their own cards. So my kids have got their own cards coming, and they can customize their own cards too. My kids don't want GMP because that's embarrassing on their cards. They've just done their own designs on a bright yellow card um, is what the kids have. So I wonder if I can give you a Revolut link now. I'm going to log in. I'm not going to do it publicly. I'll <laughs> share the screen on this. We're going to go to the Iberian FM phone in in just a moment. Yes, it is me. Oh, I think I can. Um, I uh, log in here. Um, oh, yes, it's just asking me for a few things. I'm not going to say them out loud, um, but I, I'm going through I'm going through Revolut security now. So you can just you can see how good it is. Um, OK. Oh, just digits allowed. OK, so I'm putting my my postcode in um, to verify it's me. Let me see. Um, let me see if that works. Am I through to the next level? Incorrect passcode. <laughs> Okay. Oh, passcode, not postcode. What was I thinking? Okay, let me see if that, that takes me through now. Yes, I think I'm in here. I'm going in, everybody. Confirm. Look at this. This is great security with Revolut. Confirm with the app, which I'll do now, in case you're worried about uh, the security levels on Revolut. Um, they look like they're going pretty well here, don't they? Um, asking me to double check via the app. It is app-based banking. Um, so I'm able to authorize there. I've got two minutes to do so. And my request is approved. So I'm through to the Revolut homepage and I'm going to give you a Revolut link um, to, so you can get a card of your own should you wish to do so. How cool is that? You can manage your money on, on your app, on your phone. And um, you can actually I don't think I can give you a referral link. I will put it, I think. Um, oh, the hub. Maybe the hub will help. Um, Carl, you could have been a little bit better prepared with this, quite frankly. Uh, one more click. No, okay, I can't do it. Um, I will. I will. I'll make sure you've got a, a link tomorrow, or um, I will put that on the website. 
let's see what the last few comments are saying. Do you prefer Wise? Do you prefer Revolut? Uh, let's find out. Carl, does your Revolut account have a Portuguese IBAN number or a Lithuanian one? Let me just check for you now. Uh, the giveaway, of course, will be um, that it has uh, PT at the beginning of it, right? Uh, Andrew, let me just see. Um, I'm going to my card. You can have a disposable virtual card uh, working online, and you can also have a physical card, which I just showed you. Because I think Andy's had some trouble here um, with the um, whether it's Portuguese or Lithuanian. Would that be correct, Andrew? Where on earth do I find the details of, of the... Um, again, I could have been better prepared with this. Um, in, in the complexity and the, and, the, and the moment, the pressure. I'm not able to um, find... Oh, here we go. Um, details. Here we go. Details. I'm through. I am through into my European... Um, oh, it is Lithuanian. It is Lithuanian, not Portuguese. Do, what difference does that make? Uh, does it start with an LT or a PT? It starts with an LT. Is that going to cause me problems? We've got instant consumer feedback about Revolut here. Let us know, please, if you will. Um, lovely chat uh, on the show this morning with Elaine there. Morning, Cole. Yes, uh, we would love to chat with you again. So let's make sure that happens. And yes, Graham is the chef at uh, Figs on the Funch over there. Uh, when I called Seth, they answered quickly and really helpful. I must have been lucky. Yes, you are, Louise. Um, 808 says Sarah is the area code for Hawaii. Seth is out. Is that why it's taking so long? Because they're all drinking. They've got garlanded over there in Hawaii, drinking cocktails on the beach. That's why no one answers. Quite lucky, says Antonio T. Louise, from what I've heard. Yeah, absolutely. I heard and or saw recently, and apologies for not remembering where, the temporary residency can be renewed online. That's what they want to do. On the um, Hello America, This is Portugal show last night, um, I read a few Seth articles out from Portugal resident, and they are they are trying, very trying, you might say, uh, to improve the service and of course they will they will handle so many more inquiries and processes if they do them online so they are trying to shift to that thank you james for that deagle do many shops restaurants use revolut cards absolutely if you look closely you will see on there it's a visa card okay i think it used to be a mastercard before but it's now a visa card so yes no problem at all and you can use the cash machines don't use the blue and yellow ones use the multibanco and you will be able to check your balance uh, and withdraw cash and move currency around within inside the app. You can have accounts of various kinds, including crypto, and you can buy stocks and shares and all that sort of stuff as well. 808 is a stupid Portuguese code, says Antonio. It means you just pay a local call, but as most people already have flat phone plans, don't pay for calls or cell phones and landlines, starting with two or three. It makes us pay for a call unnecessarily. Oh, um, by Randy, I have answered that question. Yes, on your online statement, top right, coulda, woulda, shoulda. Uh, your own, your money only covered up to twenty-two thousand euros from Lithuania. Um, I think um, I should be okay in, <laughs> in that case. Uh, well, I just looked. I think I've got thirteen euros in there at the moment <laughs> until I start using it in earnest. Hope Ernest doesn't mind. Wise is convenient and easy to use. Yeah, got one of those as well. Got their bright green card. I, I think it's good to have a backup. Um, when you're traveling. So I, I wouldn't I wouldn't have a problem with having both the Wise and Revolut. Uh, I love Revolut, but good to know. So yes, we are fellow Revolut users and our port and our accounts are not Portuguese, but Lithuanian with our IBAN codes there. Let's go to that IBN FM phone. And if you want to talk more about this, you can over there on that. And I'll make sure our community gets Revolut and Wise links, uh, if not later today, then on tomorrow's show. Um, and it'll be lovely if we can, if we get loads of people using Revolut cars. That's a nice little uh, extra referral um, income and income stream for the Good Morning Portugal endeavor made possible by sponsors, by associates, by affiliates. And of course, members, if you sign up as a member at gmpvip.com in our private community, you can do so for nine euros rather than the 19 euros, which is what it's going to go up to. Let's hit that button for a bit of Iberian FM phone in, shall we? Oh, should we do this first? <laughs>
I be an FM phone? You look at that. It's costume change, kind of. If you want to talk more about uh, bands that you saw as a teenager, love that. That was fantastic. People in our community who've seen the Rolling Stones and the Beatles live, folks. Kids, listen to that. You're never going to see anything like that again, I don't suppose. 913-590-303. You might want to pick up where we left off yesterday, talking about the uh, new euthanasia legislation here in Portugal. I think well, I'll open up the front pages of the English-speaking uh, Portuguese um, news sources, and we'll see what's going on there. We'll see what Guan over there on the English speaking news sources, and uh, we'll also keep an eye on your comments. You can, of course, if you prefer not to call in and talk to me, um, you can send a message on WhatsApp. I just record it into your WhatsApp and then send it to 913 590303. Thank you for all the photos that came in this morning that I didn't get a chance to get to. I will pick them up tomorrow morning, so tune in again tomorrow. Let's take a look then and see what's new at the um, Portugal resident, shall we? Um, and the front page is uh, leading with this morning, President Marcelo 